Hey what's up folks, in this video we're taking a look at the Adafruit Pi Gamer. This is Adafruit's handheld dev board that can run CircuitPython, Arduino, or Microsoft's MakeCode Arcade. It's a pretty small device packed with all sorts of hardware. It's built for creative development and it's fully open source. It's designed for beginners just getting started, as well as experienced programmers. On the front are five NeoPixel LEDs for animations and effects. There's an analog thumbstick, plus four user buttons to keep it simple. It's got 1.8 inch TFT color screen for displaying retro graphics. It's got feather compatible header, so it works with Adafruit feather wings. Eight megabytes of storage, as well as an SD card slot for extra storage. Small but powerful speaker and stereo headphone jack. It's all powered by the AtSamD51, running at 120 megahertz with 512K of flash and 192K of RAM. You can program and upload code via USB and recharge the LiPo battery. With Arduino support, you can write C++ directly for the hardware. It's great for running fast code like an NES emulator. So you can play ROMs and enjoy the classics. You can also use Arduino gaming platforms such as Gamebuino and Arduboy. If you're a game developer, you can experiment with different platforms. So whichever platform you like, it's really easy to switch between them. Pygamer brings all of these together in one device so you can play lots of different games. MakeCode Arcade is the easiest way ever to program games. All you need is a web browser. The built-in drag-and-drop code blocks make game development fun and easy. It's got a sprite editor with collision detection, particles, and hardware controls. You can use it for prototyping games or as a tool for teaching students. With CircuitPython, you can program hardware using Python code. The code is interpreted right on the Pygamer. It's a great high-level language with a fast dev cycle. Adafruit's libraries have support and drivers, so you can program all sorts of sensors. The docs have everything you need to get started. Use demo code and project examples to get up and running. Links are in the description. Adafruit's Pygamer features lots of pins and ports, so get creative and make some crazy projects. <laughs>